Good morning, Dennis Smith, and it's two-minute drill time again, and I'm going to stay focused on the hog market and more specifically the African swine fever situation that continues to spread in China. Two new cases reported this morning on Wednesday morning, and that involves one new province, a very large province in the western area of the country. So now the disease moving west. The other case this morning was in Sichuan province, which is one of the largest pork producing provinces. So the, the disease continues to spread, and I'm not sure that there's anybody that would dispute that realization. We are hearing that uh, in Beijing region, uh, they are calling all pigs, all farms that have pigs, uh, 500 head or lower. They're simply writing checks, no matter the weight of the pig, and those animals are being called. So they're trying to prevent the spread in the Beijing province to the larger pig farms. We're hearing about very poor feed demand. The, the soybean crushers in China are losing money and margins are the worst in 18 months and they cite very poor demand, very poor feed demand for the meal that they're, they're producing. Is this disease impacting the hog herd far more than we know or are they just simply trying to, to feed less protein to the pigs? Still a lot of unanswered questions. In the meantime, the summer hogs especially continue to display very good support on setbacks. These are my thoughts and not those of ADM or of ADM Investor Services, nor are they the thoughts of Archer Financial Services. Thank you.